today I'm going to be showing you some type of fucking Convolver trick. That's pretty cool. It's not going to be used in KHS Convolver. I just want to show it for people that don't have, like, you know, plugins and shit and are just using, like, stock FL. Well, I'm trying to just show you how to make a fucking tarot gun anyway. Like, so. I'm sorry if I'm, like, horrible to explain shit. I'm not really good at explaining, so. We're just going to get a fucking <laughs> ominous perk. I think FL froze. Oh. <laughs> I fucking hate this one. <laughs> Let's like layer perks, cause why not? Sure, let's just use this one too. Let's put both of these on the same channel. And then what we're gonna do is put Convolver on this bitch. There's a Refruity Convolver. Let's get another like perk we can use. I'm just gonna search up like perk in this damn thing. I have too many goddamn like sample packs, bro. At this point I can just search up wherever the fuck I want. Why do I have fucking duplicate sounds? Hold on, wait. Why can't I find nothing? Please, uh. <laughs> That's funny. Nah, I'm not gonna use oversampled, actually. Bro, what happened to my fucking kaifu packs I had? Oh, there we go. Okay. We'll just use several of these, because why the fuck not? So we got this one. Practically, I'm just gonna, like. I don't know how to explain it, actually. I'm horrible at speaking. That's not bad. I mean, we can make this a little better, but I don't know. I'm probably gonna add like a fucking multiband delay. If you don't have multiband delay, I don't know what you're doing, man. Or if you don't use it, I don't know what you're doing, man. <laughs> sure, let's add another one, I guess. We're just gonna like add some pro R so we can like add some I don't know what the fuck I, I can't I can't explain it bro I just can't fucking explain it add some room to it I guess I don't know what the hell that means okay let's just add another layer else we throw we'll like add a layer for transient or something why the fuck did I move ah! actually we could probably use like a agony perk or something like that he even has percussion oh he does excuse me she ah! We'll add this to the track, I guess. Actually, never mind. So what I'm gonna do is keep the transient, just to keep the transient, practically. This is the body. I want to keep the body, but I want to keep the sharp transient, because that makes it really good. That makes it really, really good. It makes it really, really good. We're gonna take the pro- we're gonna- we just pro R, right? We're gonna take it, put it on this track we just routed to type shit, and then we're gonna be able to mash it together. Now it's an actual gun. Ooh, it's an actual gun. Ooh. Okay, we're just gonna actually like do some stuff with this now. We're gonna make like an entire sub base and stuff like that. It's just literally just like a sine wave, if you didn't even know that. Directly how I make my subs, I put like a little pitch envelope here. You can also use like the little envelopes here too, it doesn't really matter, but I like to put it in a LFO mode. How you how you make it only like polar to one instead of bipolar, just hold shift and alt and click on this knob. It only make it polar, you know what I'm saying? So now it's only on one side, not two sides. So yeah. <laughs> Also, make this makes this on trigger mode. Don't put it on off. It's like the worst thing you could ever do. Oh yeah, make sure to put on some tack or something like that. Right now, all it's doing is just clicking, and I don't like it when it clicks. You just gotta like move this. You gotta put that up there. Yeah, put that up. Yeah. Okay, there we go. We could just do this, really. But that sounds bad, so we're not gonna do that. Be moderate with the distortion, people. Holy crap, what is wrong with y'all? We're gonna just put this on a new track. Yes, I do this. Only a little bit, though. Because it, like, distorts it a lot and it adds some more volume to it. That's the only reason why I add the song guys on my subs. Do not add me. See how much better that sounds? Sometimes y'all be motherfuckers be putting, like, OTT on your subs. Like, don't, no. Don't do that. I guess that's good enough. And now here's another technique. We're gonna like put a little delay on this. You could use KHS delay or something like that, but since we're using only stock plugins, this track we just routed to type shit. Free delay two or three, doesn't matter. Don't have the feedback up when you're doing this. Turn on the draw all the way. And then put the time to around 20-ish, 30 milliseconds-ish. <laughs> Trust me, this is the sauce you need, ladies and gentlemen. Since since it's like practically I already added like Pro R or some shit and I couldn't do really like, you know, stock plugins, we're gonna just add a multi-pass, which is KHS plugin. And I kind of learned this thing from 
<laughs> practically take out most of the 140 hertz area because it's like a lot of distortion there. Put that ding down on him. Put that ding down. <laughs> the fuck am I doing? And then we're practically gonna add distortion to it. Don't put the well, don't put the distortion all the way up. Just put like the put to like what 10 10 decibels I guess. And then just put like the mix to around like 50 percent. And then we're gonna put a little bit of disperser on this. A little bit of dispersion doesn't matter. We're gonna put it like around like, I guess let's say 3,000 hertz. <laughs> Sure. And then we're just gonna... Yeah. We're just gonna, I'm so horrible at making these. Bro. We're gonna, like... We're not gonna really mess around with these unless you wanna, like, do extra shit with it. We're just gonna slam this into a limiter. We're just gonna put, like, the end gain a lot. <laughs> Can't see ya! Distortion's usually the key here, but I barely add anything to it. Hell, the mix is, like, around 30% to 50. New technique. Use this, this, uh, distortion cold file by, Altria, by Altria. What the f- How horrible was that stutter, bro? Alright, my bad. If you don't wanna use multi-pass, or you just wanna get to the point and like add like distortion to it use distortion cold fire it's literally one of the methods that no one has talked about ever since the bullshit happened on twitter with the fucking space laces crunch method bullshit i'm so mad bro. i'm always mad at the world bro i need to chill anyways you can tweak the color knob the thing with the color it's like lowering the low end when you turn it all the way up but turning it all the way down makes the low end more and then the high end less that's probably why i like this one honestly just do something like this <laughs> There you go. To top it all off, just add a G clip or a free clip. Free clip, G clip, either or. Just add a soft clipper on if anything. You can do the same thing with free soft clipper. Yeah, free soft clipper. But G clip is also free, so you don't really need to like. You don't really have to use only stock plugins. I mean, hell. <laughs> like I tried to do that earlier in the video, and I accidentally used fucking Pro R. This track we just routed to type shit. <laughs> You can add more gain to it, clip it a little more, even a little more. I'm so fucking sorry, I need to stop. Anyways, for like finishing touches, is just add it soup to. Usually with soup to, most people would usually do is just crank the fuck out of this when it comes to highs and shit like this. Every single one of it. Depth, like every knob. I don't usually do this. What I'll usually do is unmuddy the bass first. Frankly, I'm just demudding the bass a little bit. And if you also have extra like CPU usage like at me, you can just add another fucking soup to and go wild with it. You want to like turn down the peaks a little bit, that's what I'm saying. Probably turn down the sub a little bit. Now we're just gonna make a little flow with this. That flow is actually ass. What the fuck am I doing? Yay! And that's how you make one of those type of guns. I don't know what to name it. Yeah. Don't look at any other tear out tutorials on YouTube because half of them are not even fucking useful. <laughs> Yeah, that's practically it, ladies and gentlemen.